When dividing by a multiple of 10 or 100 or 1000, etc., what we need to do is look at it in two parts. What we'll do is we'll consider the 400 as two parts, a 4 and a 100. So let's first of all divide 32.8 by 4. And we can do that probably in our head or just using pen and paper. We can say that 4 goes into 3 no times with 3 left over. Then 4 goes into 32 8 times with no remainder. We then put the decimal point down and we can say that 4 goes into 8 twice. So 32.8 divided by 4 is 8.2. Now that's one part of the division done. Now we need to take that a step further and divide by 100. When we divide by a number such as 10 or 100 or 1000 etc what we need to do is consider the number of zeros. In this case there are two zeros. Now that means that the decimal point in 8.2 will be moved two places to the left. We can see that where the arrow is pointing. We've also introduced some zeros so that our answer makes sense. So 8.2 divided by 100 means the decimal point will move two places to the left and our result will be 0.082. So the whole result for 32.8 divided by 400 is 0.082.